welcome to the body or tonight and in tonight's discussion we are going to discuss a very delicate issue So is the need of the art to ban the one thing that people have been suffering for a long time? Should body order be banned? Should people with extensive body orders be arrested? The armed janata has been silently suffering as rampant body order increases in our day-to-day -day life. People of India need an answer. People need to know. And joining me in this raging debate are Miss Shobha Knight, a well-known uh, high socialite. Hi, Shobha. Uh, hello, Arnab. Also joining me in this discussion is the man who made batting look as easy as eating vada pav, scoring hundred hundreds and putting a smile on hundreds of thousands of Indians. Kachin, please welcome to the show. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Definitely the boys. Uh, I mean, the voice is very clear. Thank you. That's all I needed to know right now. And lastly on a panel is a common man who travels in all forms of public transport, buses, autos and train. Mr. Kotem Kunyachan. Uh, you can call me KK. Let me take the first question across to Shobha. Shobha, what are your views on banning the body odor? What's your take on this? India needs answers tonight. Honor, you know, it's really sad that the infrastructure has developed, but the basic needs of the common man have yet to be addressed. When I was in Paris the other day... Shobha, I... we are not doing a travel show over here. Kachin, Kachin, yes. What are your views? Oh uh, yes, uh, basically I face the most fearsome bowlers, uh, Vaseem, Malan, but the only bowlers I am scared of are uh, Ishant and Ashish. <laughs> That's ridiculous, but they play in the same team as you. Yes, uh, but when Ashish appeals for an LBW, he raises his hands this way. I don't mind exposing my leg stump, but when Ashish exposes his underarms, I say dhao, dhao, dhao. That means run, run, run. I see your point. Even though you feel that silly point, you can't bear the stench. And considering you only reach Ishan's underarms, hugging him after he takes a wicket must be a nightmare. Yes, it's uh, worse than the nightmares Shane Barn has about me. Hold on to that, Ishan. I mean that thought. Yes, Mr. KK, are you pro this ban? Uh, pro, nahi. Pro, matlab go. This body order has to go. Yes, sir. No, sir. Okay, okay, we'll get back to you in a moment. Right now, there's a dharna being held, asking the government to ban body odor. Let's go on to the Maidan, where Arvind Kalibal is sitting down for a dharna, demanding that body odor should be banned, and a lok pass bill to be passed to the same effect. Yes, Mr. Kalibal, what are your views on this? Look, we want to do something for the country, so we want to do a dharna. But how will we do the dharna when body order is a day? How will we be able to do dharnas if we are not able to control the body order? People are being hospitalized, but not because of hunger, but the unbearable stench. Yes, I agree with Mr. Curly Ball. Obviously, you will, because even you have Curly Ball. Uh, one second, Kachin, one second. What about the times when you scored double hundreds? Yes, didn't you stink? I was supposed to sit on a dharna outside your house as well. Hey, excuse me, I already have a watchman. Uh, gentlemen. Yes, cricket is a gentleman's game. Uh, Mr. Kalibal, please, please. Thank you. Thank you so much for your input. Final words coming in from Mr. Arjun Rampal. Arjun, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Should body order be banned in India? Can you hear us, Arjun? I can hear you, man. Cool. Can I speak now? So, what's the solution? Please be cool and ban body order. Thank you so much for joining us in this discussion, Arjun. That's all we have for you on Body Order tonight. India needs answers and clearly, we shall not sleep without finding a solution to Body Order. Send us your thoughts using hashtag ban Body Order. Good night, Shabba Khair, Anupam Khair.